Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of What Is That Plant? And today we're going over Quercus falcata, also known as Southern Red Oak. Now, this oak I like to refer to as the Pointy Oak, because other, unlike its uh, cousin White Oak, Red Oaks have pointy leaves and much glossier leaves. Like you can see it right here when I do that. That like sheen. That's a glossiness. They're also a lot more brown when they finish uh, getting ready for the uh, for winter. Their leaves fall off a lot more brownish orange. Now, these ones have acorns that are a little bit bigger, a little bit chunkier, a lot longer than some of their other oak cousins. They're also very important for the environment because they provide a lot of food for wildlife and also habitat. This one doesn't have a squirrel nest in it, but uh, neither of them do, but these are also pretty isolated from other trees because they're in the middle of a courtyard. But these oaks are a little bit less useful, especially for outdoor work because they rot a lot faster than white oaks. They also tend to be younger and they only get about 60 to 80 feet hot tall instead of 80 to 100 with white with Quercus alba. Now, the good news about these trees is that they are very good shade trees and they grow a little, grow a little faster than their white cousins. These oak trees are also incredibly beautiful. Oh my gosh. And they are a very important food source for squirrels because they have large nuts. Insert joke. Uh, insert joke here. I mean, these are pretty small, but they can get quite big. And I mean, their leaves can really do range. They range from like what you saw earlier to, to this. Look at that. So freaky, so spiny. Ow, that's sharp. Ow, that actually hurts. That, that, that touched the inside of my nose. That actually hurts. Continue with your gardening. Enjoy the Quercus while they're still pretty.